Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Kedekin 1377 Welcome to my kingdom. And today we will continue our journey with episode 5 of Hogwarts Legacy. In the last episode we got our ones from Ollivanders and we visited Hogsmeade. Oh sh- oh shit, oh shit, give me this! Like yo! Alright. Uh, now we need to visit J. Pippin's potions, tomes and the scrolls, and... Um... I, I didn't see the last one, but let's see what it is. Let us go to... That's Ollivanders. Tomes and Scrolls, a specialty bookshop with various that fulfill the promise of its name. Let's go. The last one is visit, visit the Magic Neep. Interesting. An Hello. Mind. Mr. Thomas Brown, I told you I will be back, buddy. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts. Pardon me, Wilson. sir. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest. Creating something out of nothing. Of Sounds course, it is not very without nice. complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, seeing it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But mm. I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spell crafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing that like be being lovely. able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. All right. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Let us see. A potting table with a small pot to spellcraft unlocks the ability to conjure a potting table with a small pot. Use this pot to grow all sorts of useful magical plants. Wonderful. Uh, a small potions station of spellcraft unlocks the ability to conjure a small potions station perfectly suited for all, your, all of your potion brewing needs. Well, Mr. Brown, like finding just the right pleasure thing. doing business with if you. Interested, Let us see. To take a look around at the rest of my infantry i will beast feeder is spellcraft beast toy box is spellcraft lacks the ability to conjure a chopping station this station periodically produces a plant byproduct so keep an eye on it okay dung composer potting table with two large pots um potting table with a large pot material refiner hopping pot uh, potting table with a medium pot. Very, very nice inventory. You sell gear as well. Oh, no, I can sell it to him. I can sell him the flat cap for 30. Absolutely. A pleasure. Doing and the business. gold rimmed circular spectacles. You won't be needing those. Wonderful. Let me know if pleasure was all mine, Mr. Thomas you. Brown. I will, buddy. I will visit your shop again, I'm pretty sure. Oh! Before I go, uh, I'm going to just quickly yoink. <laughs> oh, what the hell? I thought it was a chest that we were going to take some coins out. <laughs> we can go upstairs. How interesting. Oh, Akio. Where are you? Akio. Ah, collect field pages in Hogsmeade, two out of two. Wonderful. What's up here? Perfect vest uniform. Hmm, nice. Alright, go to gear. I would like to know how the gear... Oh yeah, here. Appearance. Boom. House fanatic is school robe. So that is how you do it. So you just, instead of changing the clothes itself, you change your appearance by pressing... Uh, square and you can have the hood on or hood off let's keep, keep the hood on actually off off would be better never mind perfect vest 
We cannot see it. It is beneath our robe. What about our um, black gloves? Could we change his appearance? The dark arts. Headwear. Outfits. Change your appearance. Ooh. Let me um, take off the robe for a second. Um, how do I do? Yeah, okay. That's how you do it. Ooh. Ooh. That is classy. Wow. That's actually very nice. He's got the drip. He's got the drip. Alright, what else can we change the appearance of? Oh. Beak the skull mask. And we got the dark arts mask. Eat. Jesus. Um. I kind of want to. Hmm. Not sure if I want to have a mask on. Rather be Albus. Yeah. What about the appearance of our scarf? Holy shit. That's clean. That is so sick. Alright, that is going to be our outfit. Let us continue. Oof. You got the deep. Oh, uh, pardon me, sir. I was uh, changing upstairs. <laughs> Alright, let us visit J. Pippin's Potions. Where is that located at? J. Pippin's Potions, right here. Man, they have done a wonderful job just designing Hog's Head and Hog's Me. Zong's shop is right there. Alright. Walk hard and don't be afraid to fail. Level 2 lock. How are you? Fear the goblins. What are you saying? No fucking way. Can I Wingardium Leviosa? No, I can't. <laughs> Just like I did with the cat in the last episode. Oh! Leviosa! Wanted to Leviosa the rat. I'm a fucking rat. Uh, come in, we are open. I will. Hello? To J. Pippin's potions. Oh, pleasure to be here, Perry. How are you doing Pardon today? Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. No, laddie, I'm new. It's my first time in actually. Is it really? Well... Harry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating Indeed, art of potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. Indeed they, they are. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I'm interested I unveil in those. new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can, so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? Let's do that. What and now, if for you today? if I were to visit Hogwarts, if I had the chance, <laughs> um, my favorite class would have been definitely potions, because, well, if you think about the things that you can brew. The opportunities are just endless. All right, let's see what um, we can purchase. Recipe, a Duris potion recipe. Recipe for a potion that causes a rocky film to develop on the consumer's skin, helping to protect them from harm. All right. A wise decision. Vigenbell potion you. recipe. Wonderful. I take Feel those free as well. to take a look at the rest of my inventory. 
Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Will do, Mr. Pippin. I appreciate it, buddy. Focus potion recipe recipe for a potion that reduces the drinker's spell cooldown. Uh, thunder brew recipe recipe for a powerful damage potion. Invisibility potion recipe recipe for a potion that makes the drinker practically invisible. And maximum potion recipe recipe for a potion that increases the drinker's spell damage for a limited amount of time. 500, I have 217. And ingredients, he sells dung bugs, lace wing flies, stench of the dead, spider fang, leech juice, leaping toad caps, troll bogies. Troll bogies, Jesus. Mongrel fairs. And he sells these potions as well. Wonderful. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Farewell, my good sir. Alright, um, could we interact with stuff? Let me like we did with the last shop. Oh, uh, pardon me, sir. Look the other way. Relaxed jumper school uniform. Imagine they're taking someone's shop and just taking a uniform out of their, uh, their chest that is sitting right in front of them. Oh shit, you are very talented. I did visit your shop. Thank you. Alright, our last shop that we need to go and visit is the Magic Neep, which is located where exactly we will see. Three broomsticks. Which is the place that I want to visit the most and have a butter beer. Brood and pick, Steepian Sons, Hogbean Square, Honeydukes, Madame Snellings, Hogshead, The Magic Neep. Hogmeat suppliers of fresh produce, seeds, and fertilizers. Wonderful. Let's head there now. I have to go this way. West Hogmeat, Blue Flames location. Shit. Great job. What about Great job, buddy. Keep it up. Damn. Oh, Akio. One out of eight pages collected. Wow. Oh, excuse me, buddy. I'm just looking at how beautiful Hogwarts is. Damn. All right, let's go to the Magic Neep. Well, hello there. Hello. Oh, hello there. Hello, Please Timothy. <laughs> Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. Not really. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Great Not job. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop. Practicing the, the power of now. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let's do that. Let's also Let do that. You're after something fresh. Indeed I am. Do have a look at That is all. Now we go and find Sebastian. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Oh shit, what was that? Six coins. A yoinked. Goodbye, dumbass. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh god. Uh, time to go and meet Sebastian at the town circle. Uh, before we go, Sebastian, we need to go and have a butter beer. Damn, I love this place. Very, very cool looking. Mm. Oh shit, back up. <laughs> you almost hit me. Shit. Very cool. Levioso. Can we live you also? Wait, wait, wait. Watch, watch, watch. Ah, come on. L1, R2, L2, R2. Sickle. Ah, not fast enough. Okay. I can do this. I can do this. I'm going to live you also their ball. Ah, almost. Hello? 
What's in here? Nothing. Sebastian. Oh shit, look at Honeydukes. Excuse me, Sebastian, I'll be right back. We need to go and visit Honeydukes. Oh shit. We can enter. Holy shit. Look how cool this place is. Wow. This is so cool. Wow. Unbelievable. Nom 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 nom. Let's eat everything. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Holy shit. What is this? What flavor? Oh! Oh shit! Oh shit! Put us down please, thank you. Oh, Doxy Floss. Don't mind if I do. Shit. <laughs> this is so fucking cool. Wow. Unbelievable. Hello. What are you purchasing? Uh. Let's see. Elephant on a bicycle. Oh shit! <laughs> that shit is so cool. Alright. What about this? 16 coins. Don't mind if I do. What does this do? Pepper imps. Oh shit! Wow, that could be useful when you're trying to set up a bonfire. You don't even need matches. <laughs> Uh, Alright, level 2 lock. Let's go meet Sebastian. What a wonderful shop. We will definitely visit this place again. Sebastian, sorry buddy, I got distracted. Did you manage to find the things for your, have all of my supplies. for your sister, buddy? Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. Oh shit. Are you fucking shitting me? What in the fucking hell? Just a random troll? Away from the building! Away from the building! Ah, he's gonna destroy Honeydukes, huh? Nope. Okay, back up. Let's see. Dodge! You can't get me! Come on. Come on, buddy. Love you. Okay. Love you also? Oh, shit. That's not good. Nice move. Back, 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 back. Charge me, charge me. Dumbass. I won. Nope. <laughs> nope, nope. Don't repair him. Okay. Back up, back up, back up. Shit, shit. Headshot. Back up, back up, back up. Ancient magic throw. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, shit. Wow, he can actually double attack. Okay, we gotta dodge that. Boom. <laughs> Stop that, you shit. Back. Back. Oh, shit. Dumbass. Idiot. Boom. Back up, back up, back up. I tried to put Tego to save him. Couldn't. Back up. You can't get me, you stupid idiot troll. Boom. Or one boom. Or one boom. 
Ooh, dumbass. R1. Boom. You ain't got nothing on you. To invoke ancient magic. L1 plus R1. Boom. Shit. Troll with punches. Unbelievable. Goodness. A second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? By yourselves. Indeed we did, so. madam. Indeed we did. Blur, to be honest. Merlin's I'm Albus. Albus wannabe. Right? We are, and we were glad to help. <laughs> I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. You're welcome. In fact, madam, I am... Oh, shit. She just apparated away. In fact, I am a master at repair Oh, hello there. Um, a moment, if you would. I'll go and see what he wants. All right. I'm just going to repair all these. R2. Repair them. Beautiful. Ah. Don't worry, Hogsmeade. Albus wannabe is here. And let me be clear, everything is going to go be the way just they, that they were. Great poets. <laughs> Alright, um, allow me. Oh, just imagine cleaning your room and you had the ability to use repair. How cool would that have been? And how much time would you have saved? Alright, we need to repair two more items. Repair. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Indeed. And let me collect that as well. I appreciate it. Oh, hello buddy. Come here, it's okay. Did that troll scare you? It's okay, buddy. It's okay. Good boy. All right, let us repair this as well. Repair. And I'm here done. Oh, Accio. I saw it just for a moment, though. All right, let me uh, trim up this tree as well. Beautiful. Oh, I'm going to get that page. Where are you? Accio. What is that creature? Hey! Oh shit! Ah, didn't mean to scare you, buddy. Let's go and uh, speak to the shopkeeper. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Ah, Mr. Hill, thank you. I appreciate it. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. You Allow make a great cup of tea, sir. Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls. Uh -huh. And not to mention your no, help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. You're welcome. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I am Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Wow. No, sir, that's far too generous. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, now, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Let's see. Take your time. Offense 5. Uh, preview I'd gear. Say that looks as if it was made for you. And we can compare. Uh, both are level 1, but the offense goes up by 5. Thank you. you. Be disappointed. Oh, shit. You received a new piece of gear. Time to equip it. Let's do that. Your current defense and offense are displayed at the top right of the screen. Select the cloak and robes in the gear. Alright, equip a robe. 
I sort of do not want to be wearing that robe though. I know you, it grants you five offense, but the Deep goes back to zero. Legendary. Ooh, 500 apiece. Can we pre uh, preview I'd say this? that looks as if it was made for you. Sheesh. <laughs> what about this one? This one has a Gilderoy Lockhart feel to it. No, thank you. What I'd about this legendary cloak? Made for you. Wonderful. All right. Thank you. I suspect you have a sharp eye. Mr. Hill, I'd say way too generous. A bus or two, wouldn't you? Might Absolutely. help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. Let us go, let us go. I sell even more battle-worthy items. Should you be inclined? Oh, shit. You're most welcome to peruse my shop. What are you at looking your... at? <laughs> okay. Let us Hello go there. and have a, a water fashion, beer. Let's go, Sebastian. Before we go, let me uh, change my clothes. Um, no robes needed. Oof. Could we actually equip this and then change its appearance? Because it gives us four defense to this. Yes, we can. All right. So now we got four defense and five offense. Wonderful. I like that. Uh, so appearance and utter bedlam in there. You might even meet Serona, the owner. And clothes are two different things in this game. All right. Time for some cold butter beer. I haven't had one in real life. If if you've had one, let me know in the comments down below what you actually thought about it. Oh shit. Who was that? Oh shit, Ranrock. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. Oh, he's after I us. I gave you a distraction. <laughs> I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? Albus. All you need to know is Albus wannabe is the name. The child, then you have no value to me. Interesting. <laughs> Let's go. You're not even gonna have butter beer. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Oh, Grandma so that's Victor Rookwood. With Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, what? let's get inside the three broomsticks. Shit. All right. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. All right, just, uh... Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> Elbows. Elbows wanna be. Butterbeer's on me. Oh. Heard about the attack. Finally, I shall be looking butterbeers. in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. Thank you, buddy. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> ah, shit. Time to fight. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. Uh, my friend me? is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said... My friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. 
The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink you butter beer that. forever. You piece of shit. I'll be waiting for you outside. Let me just finish my butterbeer. <laughs> Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Let's do that. Let's do that. Ah, oh, let me have some muffins. What happened to my butter beer? Hey, uh, what was her name? Serena? Serona? I need some butter beer. Ah, oh, shit. All right. What is up here? Oh, we can go one more level up. Ooh, search the bag. 46 coins. Hell yeah. What's in here? How many levels are in this store? What's in this room? Well, we just exit. Anyways. Sebastian. Shall we make our way back? I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for getting back after hours. Certainly not. Let's get back. You must return to your common room, uh, access the map. Select Hogwarts on the map. Fast travel to your common room. We shall do so. Travel. Very interesting now. That um, Rockwood is after us. You have to wait and see what happens. Unfortunately, guys, I have to end this episode right here. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And ring the bell to stay notified for my upcoming videos. Until the next time, guys. Godspeed.